kumekuwa na matatizo kuhusiana na mtu mmoja pale kati ya kanisa na na mawengine wa kule mtaani so uh, eventually it has not as where we are today uh, i can talk about today i left for my leave i came here on Thursday Friday I was around yesterday I was around but yesterday I received some information there are people planning to to disorganize the whole program of the day and actually I will inform the, 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 the police and today around 6 I had a lot of commotion outside I came out and peeped I saw some five drunk at fellows but uh, surprisingly they are not part of my congregation I don't know them so for my understanding was that uh, they are not people interested in church or in church matters but uh, somebody maybe had a meeting with them at night drank them intoxicated them and sent them to come and block all the gates actually there was no access to the compound it's my responsibility as the pastor in charge to take care of church property not even a politician will allow me to do that i am ready to pay the price and i'll pay it but i'll ensure everything will be like one thing i'm I, i'm not born there i'm an outsider as they say so i have to go back where i belong and uh, somebody is agitating for that and uh, i understand that that is a big reason that why are you here you should go to your place so is it politically get? Yeah, there's political dimension, there's tribal dimension, and uh, we'll have to return it. What about uh, on the allegations of financial uh, misappropriation? I have no comment about that. Oh. Because uh, as I began, those are just, I can call them outsiders, so I have nothing with them. There's, uh, there's nothing I can say about whatever they say. If they are right to say whatever they want to say, they are free.